Ryan's doing a good job of pushing them away from the Medusa. Nico Baby still struggling. But so is 23 on the bottom side. That's four. What? They might have to kill it. They've got the bite. Four Mangos. That's for trying to hide White Mont. He's, He's going to be able to find him. He's found him. Yes, he is. First blood there for White Mont on the safe lane. How many mangoes did he use there? I think he used three to commit for that kill because he had four when he started. Suicided, he'll be able to help out limp a bit here. And now they're making rotation. So let's see if they can catch anything off guard here. White Mont. A stun, but Carl. Oh, Carl's got a DD. Oh, he's got a DD. Get away from the Necrophos. Get away from... You're not going to be able to with the scythe coming down on a FNG. He's out. Limp gets a return kill, though. Something much needed for him. Well, if Alliance does look to make a play onto him, but he, perhaps he's thinking that they just don't have the damage for him. Because when I do look at Alliance's draft, they are definitely lacking in the damage department until later stages. Oh, and here we have... Oh, Arcane! He really wanted that Arcane. He's not going to get it, White Mom. And now Limp. What, is that enough? Might go down. It, it is. is. Carl does the maths. The scythe comes down perfectly. Limp's out of it. They're throwing out the tips as well, T1. They know that Limp is not having a fun game. No. They want to make sure he's fully aware of it here, drawing attention to it with the tips. And with the timing of the push too, 10 minutes. Like look at Limp's positioning now too. He's able to take advantage of this a bit here because he got so much information from it. And they know where Limp's at, of course. We've been pulling the wave as such. They get the setup, Cookie. He's got a remnant down. But they've got the roof. Oh, they have and enough. Side, I mean, that was. What was he, was he doing that? I mean, he, he's got creeps on him. They, they know exactly where he is. I guess he just didn't expect them to be able to chain lock him down, but I T1 absolutely did. I mean, they did play it around the tree line perfectly. I they, don't think they he saw the three of them. Nicely. So, and now another Cookie, Hanskin. T1 there, yeah, looking very hot right now. Eight yeah. for three, two K up. Nico Baby still holding on with the farm. That's for looking for a grab. Yeah. Got the blade mail. And they're gonna try and go for Goop, but he got the skew off, so a bit of distance created. And he, whilst he does end up dying, now they've ended up being pretty deep, Carl. Gonna look to chase down S4. They've got the kisses coming in. That's gonna be one of them. Limp's gotta run. Hanskin's getting away, at the least for them. Limp over as well. Yeah, he's still got another remnant, so. I mean, they're still chasing. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> Rod's up. He's got, he, the stun. I, they've caught he's him. He's actually dead. Oh my goodness. Oh, ho, ho. Arcane rune for the win. Yeah, Carl just for runs Carl him down. Carl can take. Scythe, he's gonna be off the map for like 60 seconds at 15 minutes. That would have been it. Pretty brutal. See, that's Ken. Oh, no, maybe White Mon in the mid lane, bottom lane, FNG. Lots to set things up. The oh, oh, he, he gets the laps the off. Laps off. But he will die. He'll still die. And Carl gets the last hit, so full mana, full health continues. Oh, Nico Baby. He's going to try and find him. But Just able to jump over the tree lines. And you can really see, yeah, Alliance not really in any sort of rush to get stuff done. As Nico Baby, they're just keeping him safe, giving him a good area of the map to farm in. That's getting not standing a chance there, though. Savage able to catch him off guard with the E Blade burst. Turns into the Knicks, stuns him, sets up his own shotgun. Still 30 seconds on Aegis, he's going confident. Oh, 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 it's oh, a three one. Oh, oh my goodness. He just jumped in and got the three. And oh the goo -goo. my God. Just they are all dead. Nowhere. Oh, dude, we weren't, nobody was expecting that. That's, that, that just happened. And now just down the mid. That's a tier two going down for 25 minutes in it. Oh, well, Cuckoo had, had enough. That is not good. I'd, yeah. Well, Cuckoo, <laughs> he's in again. He's in again. Is, is he going to be able to find another horn? They're going in with a duel on Cuckoo. Can they keep him alive? They're in with the heels. He is still alive. He he's, is he's still, still alive. alive. He's out with the skewer. He he's won still the duel. Alive. He's out. He's away. Well, I don't know what happened there. Well, the game's over. I mean, maybe he got a text from his girlfriend saying she was home alone. Because uh, he just ended the game.
what, a, what an ending. Koo just clo he closes it up. And uh, that's, yeah, GG. Wow. Well, <laughs> there we go. Well, they were slowing there the pace of the game down nicely oh. on the side of Alliance until a, uh, a big kaboom. Yeah, wow. Aegis had, what, Aegis had 30 seconds left, and Cuckoo's like, you know what? We don't need it. I'm just going to get a three-man um, horn toss into We our... are going Boom. next, ladies and gentlemen. This game's over. Cuckoo has declared it. Wow. Uh, wow. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, quite a hand in there. Yeah, that was the explosive. T1.